Hello and welcome back. <laughs> Today I'm on a group dig with the Southern Seekers UK. Uh, great setup, um, good bunch of guys. Um, I won't mess about. Um, hello, Andy. I'm with Andy, by the way. Andrew Jones. He's back there somewhere. Probably see yourself in there, Andy, somewhere, mate. There you go, on your knees somewhere. Uh, yeah, I've, uh, I'm on my first interest in single. I've had uh, a bit of copper pipe, lump of lead, as you do. Um, It's a butter. Okay, here it is. Let's get in the sun. It's a little git. It's a little, little button. Um, can't see it looks shiny underneath, so uh, yeah. let me uh, let me clean it up and I'll get back to you. There you go. Yeah, a nice shiny button. I think it's a tombite button. Wouldn't it be nice if it was silver? <laughs> I don't think it is though. Uh, anyway, for the first time today, moving on. Mm, well, there's something in here. Getting on the light. Let's see what it is. I think it's rubbish. When is it never? Not. Uh, yeah. Oh, dear. Oh. Oh. That's odd. It's got something on the back. Ooh. Let me clean it up and I'll get back to you. It was just a butterfly shaped bit of lead. Is all. Oh dear. How exciting could that be? Anyway, moving on. Next signal just popped up right in there. Is a lovely dropped musket ball. Well, I'm assuming dropped. It's a beauty, look at that. Nice and white. Good age to it, that. <laughs> Moving on. This next signal is a little bit interesting. You ready? Ooh, spoon handle, I'm thinking. But uh, let me clean it up and I'll show you. Come on, be something more than a spoon handle. Yeah, a little bit weird, but uh, I think that's just a pewter spoon handle. That odd flip up at the end, I don't know. Uh, if you think it's, a, it's anything other than a pewter spoon handle, give it a shout. Moving on. There you go. Beautiful. Sunshine. Gothic florin. I'm going to Found put the video. I'm the going to put the video as well on YouTube. Amazing. What's your name? Do YouTube search. Search. What's your YouTube channel? Sergey Haxel. Sergey Haxel. Oh, I'll find that. I'm going to comment on your videos. Yeah, as well. that's that's beautiful. Well done, Mail China. 
Second silver as Second well. Second silver, first one is dead. <laughs> With the uh, 80 Pro and, <laughs> and the, the little, steering wheel. <laughs> the little steering wheel. <laughs> All the best, buddy. Oh, you too, mate. Take care. Okay, next signal is the tiniest of buttons. That is a tiddler. Little button with the shank on. Ooh, there you go. Anyway, moving on. Ooh, where are you? Round in the hole. A lovely 8081 solid signal on the 80 Max. And uh, yes, I teased it out of the hole. Let me show you how it fell out of the clod. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Ooh, it's there somewhere. It is, look. Oh, that's a good chunky one, isn't it? Hey, I wonder what this is. It's got quite heavy, actually. It's got some weight to it. Ooh, just let me give it a little dry brush and uh, we'll see if anything comes up on it. George, I reckon. George third? Yeah. One second. Well, it is a coin. Uh, that side is pretty toasty unless you can see anything on it, but look at the other side. I don't get it right, so I think you can see in the sun. What on earth is that? Has anybody got any idea? It's like an, is that an animal? God oh dear, I'll have to do a bit of research on that. If I find out, obviously it'll come up next. Otherwise, or if you let me know, what is that? Is that a dinosaur? <laughs> God, no. Yeah, as I say, the other side is sadly toast. Uh, I can't see any loads of bust on it or anything, but this side, it's a good round coin, so it's... But what is that? Oh dear. Anyway, moving on. Now, I'll let you see this as I saw it when the clog popped over. What's in there, I wonder? Let's take a look. It's quite big. Oh, and it's quite nice. That is... Oh, that's a lovely. George. Sorry, I was looking at it then. It's a George and it's in good condition. Oh, let me just give it a light brush and I'll get back to you. Oh, you beauty, look at that. 1806, George the third ain't me. Look at the back. Oops, sorry, she's upside down. Ready? There she is. Hello Britannia, brilliant, hello George, you old mad old git, anyway, <clears throat> moving on, banging 82, 81, on the 80 Max, what do you think it was, go on have a guess, yes, or oh, no, uh, whichever you chose, it we're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time, Yes, it's half a horseshoe. Hooray! <laughs> oh well, moving on. Well, I think I've got a little buckle here. Let's have a look, shall we? There it is. Uh, yeah. Interesting. I think it's one of those, yeah, you can see what type of buckle it is. Oh, that's interesting. I'll give it a quick clean up and I'll show you. Well, it's not that old, still got its pin in, but uh, hey, it's a buckle, isn't it? Ooh, old claggy and muddy. Uh, anyway, moving on. Now, I do like to show you how it, uh, it pops out of the clod. So here we go. This is how this one popped out. That's not my hand, by the way. There you go. Round in the hole, and... Uh, oh, that one feels the light. Let's get it in the light. And I have no idea. I can't see the glare of the camera right on the screen. Let me have a little scrub up and I'll get back to you. No, I'm afraid there's nothing on that. That is toast. Uh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> it's a George, isn't it? They always are. Oh, I don't know. Copper toast. Mmm. Toasty McToasty son. Isn't that what you say, Grim? <laughs> oh dear. Anyway, moving on. Signal is. Coveen Barrier Cream. There you go. Now that is a tube and a half of real barrier cream. Get in, eh? 
bugger. Moving on. There it is. It's small, it's round, and it ain't no button. I'm going to give that a little light brushing, and I'll get back to you. And the survey said... <coughs> no, it ain't Roman. I thought it was. Look at bumming things. Just an old button tongue. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. Moving on. I'll tell you what, if this was smell vision you would not be having a great time. It's been spread. Muck spread and it bloody stinks. But it's fun. And moving on. More round in the hole. Ooh, yeah. No idea what it is. There you go. off there. Uh, can we see anything? No. Can we see anything on the other side? No. Give me a second, I'll give it a sprue. Well, I can see some of these bouffants. I think, is that George II? I think. I'm not sure, but I think that is. Some bouffant man. Oh, well, there you go. Another one. Another round in the hole. Mm, moving on. Our next signal is this little button. No shank. Oh, it's a button. Oh, the front of a button. So, I mean, I'm sure there was design on there. Thought I saw something, but I'm obviously, I'm obviously going mad. Oh well, a little bit of silver gilt, eh? Can't beat it. Moving on. Another tiny button. I think I've landed on Button Moon. Well, not really, obviously, because I'm not on the moon. I'm not a children's TV character. Anyway, never mind, moving on. Well, hey, here with Andy on this, um, is it Southern Seekers UK dig? Yeah, that's the one. And it's, uh, well, obviously I'm doing this intro in the middle. And it's been all right, hasn't it? Yeah, it's been good, it's been good. <laughs> Hot. Hot, gorgeous. Some good finds. And some good finds. Yeah. Somebody's had a, uh, or I'll show, actually it's in this video, um, somebody's had, had a uh, silver gothic flooring that's really worn. Right. We're going to have a, a mad half an hour. We're going to do 30 minutes. Um, this will be sort of in the end. We're going to do 30 minutes to see who can find the best thing in 30 minutes. <laughs> go. So, three, two, one, go. Here is a wee button, a little button. But this is a bit interesting. It's a cuff button. It has got a pattern on it. Can you see it? Mm, just about see it there. Try and clean it and get some better pictures. It has got something on that. Can you see it? Is it upside down? Oh well, never mind. Let's see if we can get some better pictures. Moving on, <clears throat> look at a lot of this on group digs. Look at that nice hole. Listen to the signal. Late 60s. I'm going to dig that, see what it is. See what they left behind. Interesting, isn't it? Now, as it turns out, it was just that bit of plate. But look. Oh, it didn't even put it grass up. I'll put it back in properly. Cool, I tell ya. Cool. I wish it'd have been something good. <laughs> That'd be funny. Anyway, moving on. Ooh, I think I've got some last minute round in the hole. See, let's have a look, shall we? Oh, it's in there. You ready? You ready? Ooh, now then. What's this? No idea. Probably, I don't know, probably a button. There's the impression. Oh, looks interesting. Oh, it looks interesting. 
Just let me give it a quick scrub. Oh God, can a man get a break? Just a toasted little copper, I don't know, farthing maybe, just a token of some form. There is some detail on it. It's not bloody Roman, is it? Oh, hey. You can see what I meant though, can't you? I think I've got Roman on the brain. The Roman. Oh well, there you go. It's another coin. Hooray! Moving on. Well, that's the last signal of the day for me. A piece of lead. Is it? Is it a trumpet from the Mouse Wars? Oh. Yeah. It's just lead in it. Right, move into the car. Right, I fancied a nice green mm. backdrop. I think I've caught the sun. Anyway, that's all for me. So, um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Thanks for uh, coming along. Hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> what, what there is to enjoy. Uh, yeah, um, and he's up there somewhere. I oh, know he's, uh, he's. I think he's just digging all. Probably his last as well. Uh, so yeah, I'll uh, bid you adieu to you and you and you, and um, wish you the very best of luck on your next hunt. Don't forget to fill your holes. Uh, unlike quite a few people on this dig, um, and wear gloves. And oh, sorry about that. And I will catch you on the next. Take care. Bye. Oh. Thank you very much, by the way, Nigel, for the old hat. Um, you know, look. Let's not talk about look. It's just a nice hat. Move into the car. <laughs>